Well, I think in the beginning, women are really afraid to try to get help because they feel like after somebody for a long time tells you that you're not worth anything or that you're completely controlled by them and you feel like you can't get loose of that, that you can't shake that, you're never going to be able to move on with your life because they're always going to be right there. They, there's, there's not a lot of support out there for women that come from domestic violence. And so when there's programs like this, it actually helps you to pull through. It gives you strength to want to fight back. It gives you that, um, that sense that you're doing the right thing, that you're not over-exaggerating or you're not like um, making things up in your head, you know what I mean? But it's a really scary feeling when you feel like you're by yourself. Crystal has a lot of strength, she has a lot of courage. The journey that she's been on has been very difficult. She has been um, through the system, and sometimes the system has not always supported her and her family. It's been really difficult. Um, there's been protection order violations, there's been um, stalking, uh, she's, she's gone through the gamut. She continues to be strong. She continues to support her three kids. She has done everything she can. She really, really is a hero. People who've never been in the situation don't understand how how scary and how mobilizing it is when you go through these situations you honestly feel like you can't get out and I would want to bring a sense of strength to other women.